Off to the future. Yes. Uh, do we have to jump those? No, but we used to. Oh. I remember that. Oh. Ow. Just uh, kind of did it because it it's like the the lava thing. Interesting fact: um, four years from now is when uh, we will be on flying hoverboards. Back to the Future had it wrong, Ninja Turtles had it right. Oh, is that is this is 2020? Yeah. I, I wasn't paying attention. I was messing with the video. Although it could be 2020 uh, in an alternate universe. I mean, like. Which one? Which one of these things do you not believe that there are mutant turtles that are human size, or uh, that there are uh, hoverboards in four years? We kind of have some versions of hoverboard. That's what I I recall seeing. Hey, functioning. Well, if guns. you mean the one that catch that catch fire and people fall off of and break their face. Yeah, that sort of thing. Although, technically, Back to the Future is right, because those also do not work on water. Uh, but this, I like this F-Zero level that they were able yeah. to steal from Nintendo, because I know F-Zero is not a Konami game. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, I think your theory is right. Um... And then somehow Krang has magically shrunk his... Uh, ro his robot body, cyborg body, whatever. Yeah, because it 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 was the si the size of a skyscraper. Also, if you're going to invent a body for yourself to fly around in, you'd think you might come up with a slightly better protection for yourself than leaving your brain in the abdomen. Yeah, you think you'd put your yourself into like the head capsule I mean there's a reason why why our brains are in our head it's an easily defensible spot you know an interesting fact about brains nope there actually aren't any no I thought you were gonna look one up <laughs> no I did there weren't any brains are boring um <laughs> says the former psych major ah the puke bombs you know what's crazy is uh, there's the big controversy about bath beads in 2016. Did not realize that they would come back as weapons in four years. That's an interesting point. Going to pie. Beyond Night Riders. And like all great evil geniuses that uh, lead clans of. Uh, foot soldier clone armies. Yeah. Uh, when he had the robot body, he made it a pasty white guy. Just like Darth Vader. Well, Darth Vader was a pasty white guy that was yeah. more machine than man now. What I said was true, in a sense. I certainly wasn't Lucas not planning ahead. Um, this was your father's pizza box. Who wanted you to have it when you had one health? Also, the other crazy thing is, uh, if you believe Neil deGrasse Tyson, and uh, I do because I listen to Star Talk. Uh, Generally, you should. Time and space are tied together, so somehow our time has fluctuated, and we've ended up on Mars. Well, I thought this was like a Dimension X thing. Oh. I thought you were going to say this was a uh, post-apocalyptic future, like Wally. -E. Or Fallout? Yeah, they're basically the same. That'd be... Although, I guess Fallout's a little more uh, oh. optimistic. Oh. So, uh, how do we get these continues? I don't know. Uh, I don't know uh, how many continues we get. I think we might have, like, three each. 
Which means that I'm on my last. We definitely should have uh, looked at the options first. Maybe put it on easy because we're old people now. Yeah, that was back when games came with instruction booklets. I mean, they still kind of do. But they... Instead, they actually teach you in the game with long, long tutorials. Which actually, I don't think is too bad. But I, um... The problem is, when, like me, when you have a kid and then you come back to the game about six months later and say, uh, how do I do these controls? I've already gotten past the part where I learned how to do it, but I haven't done anything of the game where you actually do it. Also, it turns out you're wrong about the, uh... Ah! Well, it, I was correct, and then the future was altered. Oh, okay. I'll accept that reasoning. Why, why did they make this room? <laughs> See, this makes a little bit more sense that a ball like this doesn't break the floor that's only bouncing a few feet above it. And it's swiping to the side. It's not approving of us. Yeah. Because it's swiping left. I feel like that would be a... Uh, this, uh, this could be a uh, Sonic the Hedgehog or... Uh... Indiana Jones type of level with your, if you're gonna have those kinds of cool things. Oh, oh, that's that's different. Why don't they have why don't they have bats? I think... Now I'm thinking on it. I think I might know what... Oh, those are the guys. Th those things. They might be, um... I believe they're called Tonfas. They're basically... Nearly identical to the, uh... Uh... Um... Police... Batons. Oh, like in I thought you were going to say the Ginsu knife. And I did not realize that that was a part of... Formal, uh, ninja training. Well, but I mean, like ninjas are real stealthy, so you would need to be able to cut through a tin can silently. Haha! -ha. So you can get away. You might want uh, some health. Nope, nope, you're gonna want it. Oh wait, I'm still alive. Oh, that inconceivable! <laughs> this is the problem when your health is the same color as the. It's the background. Oh, cool. Yeah. This is the dorkiest spaceship ever, Crane. You like you get some cool points for the whole, uh, uh, like your weird robot thing. Also curious why. Uh... He has a foot on it. I mean, I know he's, like, the Foot Clan or whatever they're uh, referring to themselves to. But I mean, like, you can only take that motif so far, and then it's like, well, you're a brain, you don't have to. Yeah, you have, like, little tendrils. Oh, he dropped out little Ikea tables to fight us. <laughs> may have an upset baby on the recording. Oh, I thought that was the game. I thought that was Shredder yelling. I had my new head cannon. Ah, oh. Judo Smash. Ah. Actually, that does look like the robot from, uh... What's the... What was, uh, not... Battery not included? Yes, I wanted to say Short Circuit, and I know that's a completely different looking robot. That's the movie with the... 
the Indian guy who's not Indian. That's our hole. That hole's our way out of. Uh, <laughs> We've skipped past our actual time, and now to return to the glorious year of 1994, too. <laughs> they used that pun twice? <sighs> Shame. Shame. Kind of disappointing that there, there isn't a... You would think, uh. You'd think he'd have something better to use than, like. Basic Green Lantern, uh. esque power. Superman powers, like. Well, the green one is. like, turns you back into a instant normal kill? Power. Yeah, I think it is an instant kill. I think we might actually get this. Mm. I don't know so if either of us have. I don't know if either of us have any continues. I'm kind of curious why he uses anything besides the green one. It is kind of easier to dodge, it seems. Like this, it takes a little bit longer for him to shoot it out, it seems, and it. Not like the flame, which leaves a trail of of danger. Ice is handy because it hits in the air. So if you try to do that, like... Yeah, but I think I've only pushed the jump button about seven times this whole game. <laughs> <laughs> Why start now? Oh, I thought he got gotcha. you. Nope. I had uh, invincibility frames thanks to being hurt by his flames of his aura. Jumping around and holding your toe actually is a great defense against fire and magic. There we go. Oh, that's not good. Oh, crap. That's what you get for saying you think we're going to do it. I, I think we still can. Aha! For being a, kill a kid's game, there's a lot of people falling off buildings. Yeah, but he might be alright. <laughs> you need to edit an explosion in there. Yeah. Very impressive for such young students. I'm sorry, your pizza is in another castle. The final test in your training lies ahead. Defeat the hard mode and you will become true ninjas. This is what we call moving the goalpost. <laughs> I'm sorry, you needed 37 seconds faster to become true ninjas. I feel sorry for Leonardo the most. He's sitting over on the bench going, What the heck, man? I played till the last minute. <laughs> 
Hey, don't worry. Your plus minus is fantastic. <laughs> Enjoy that. That's one of the few sports jokes you'll ever get out of me. Yeah, it's a niche hockey joke. Yes. Do let's I see. Uh, let's see what the the options had, so I could see if that was. No. Uh... Oh. oh, you get more continues with hard. And you can change that. What's the rest? Ah, lives. Yeah, so... We had the least amount of lives possible. Why is that not tied to the hard, easy, yeah. and whatever? Should have had that manual. Oh, let's see. Oh, yeah, this is one of the few games where you could change the color modes. Yeah, yep. You want to do versus? Since we have, uh, like a couple minutes. I don't know what Versus is, but sure. As soon as I watch this demo. <laughs> I think we just beat each other up. We just wail on each other? Yeah. I don't feel like there's really any nuance that you could have to it, because it's not like there's... There is a time limit. Nothing like a stick in the back. No. I'm just gonna keep uh, flinging you, judo chop style. Oh, or you could do that to me, whatever. Oh, this is just... Man with <laughs> turtle with stick speak softly. Ah! Oh, and there it is. You oh, get I a slice a pizza. of pizza. My children will fight for their food. Best out of twenty-seven. Wait, how many? How many? How many uh, slices of pizza are in a pie? Uh, I mean, this is the best out of It's 15. all a matter of how you slice it. Oh man, I'm getting my ass kicked. Whoa, what? Is there a defend? My, my head went into. Uh, I don't want to know what your head went into. <laughs> Ah ha ha! Wow! I did not I'm think I was gonna. Not really die. sure what happened there. I I ninjaed you. Ah. New game. What yeah. did we learn? I don't know. I don't think I learned anything. Yeah, I don't think I learned anything other than my head goes into my shell. But that doesn't help you any. It didn't <laughs> look like. All right, that seems like a good third episode. This is, uh, this is, uh, this has been a lot of fun, uh, reliving, reliving the youth, as it were. Yeah, stay tuned for my next guest visit, when I will, uh, have a big announcement. Yes. Yes, my big announcement actually takes place in the year 1530. You're gonna have to go to Wikipedia to find out what it is. Don't worry, people, we're not going to graffiti, uh, Wikipedia. I've done that once, uh, but for the greater good. Was it to save the uh, African elephant? No, <laughs> it was to insult uh, 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 David Maskevich, uh, the, the, the head of the uh, Scientology. Uh, a, a screen pick of my graffiti is still up on uh, Encyclopedia Dramatica. <laughs> All right. So long. Over and out. Blah, 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 blah. Or not. <laughs>